Hi everyone, it's Gail. I wanted to come on this morning and do a quick video to let you know which of the journals um, won my next daily journal little uh, vote from yesterday. And then also I wanted to go through a lot of you talked about various uh, uses for journals. So I wanted to just show you the ones that I am using currently and, um, and, and, and talk about that a little bit. The other thing is I realized I should have put the information for all these ladies that made these journals in the description box. I'm going to do that on this video so that um, you can go check out their uh, Check out YouTube, check out um, their Etsy stores and such. So on this little guest check, I have um, I have done my little results here. And um, and what we, what we have is Journal A, this journal, got 36 votes. Journal B got 23 votes. And Journal C got 116 votes. <laughs> so Journal C did go ahead and, and win the day, if you will. And so that's kind of that's kind of fun. So um I am gonna I'm gonna decorate up this guest check a little bit and I'm gonna just slide it right in there because you were so helpful to help me figure out what I was what I was going to do next. And I've already had, I already have one night of writing in it. So, so there you go. That is going to be my daily journal. And, um, uh, several of you that voted for journal B said, what about using it for travel or whatever? Well, I have currently a travel journal happen in here. Um, I had this tucked in because I actually just took it on a little trip. But um, this journal, it's the journal cover is wonderful. And I actually, I do in one of my um, journal collection videos, I say who made these things. And um, <clears throat> I didn't prepare that for this video. I will just put the three in there. So anyway, um, this little traveler's notebook, I made this. Um, myself and usually don't use the journals that I make but um, but I like this one so I've got my trip to Italy in there that was that was like eight years ago um, and that was in another little uh, little kind of a notebook type this was bef way before I started making journals and I just cut it out and um, clipped it on here because I wanted all my travel to be together. Um, we have a universal trip in here and lots of memorabilia with that. Um, I think I have, that was kind of some of my favorites on that particular trip. Um, and, you know, envelopes with things in them. Um, this was just from Daphne's diary and I just, I love Daphne's diary stuff. So put that in there. Um, this one was one of the retreats in Anaconda. I forgot to take it with me on this last one, which was a dumb thing. This is a pen that I got from the Rusty Peacock on, um, on Etsy. And then as you can see, I still have quite a bit more room. So this one, we have some up, we have an upcoming trip and I will definitely be taking this one to, to journal in. So then, um, uh, uh, so those, those two we have another one that I do daily is this one. This cover came from Shannon Green and, um, I like it cause I could, I can add more books in here if I want to. Right now, I just have a journal that, again, that I made that, um, this is that uh, fabric paper, paper fabric, that uh, I actually made one of those um, when my arm was in a sling. I did a video on how to make this, how to make this paper fabric. So this is my gratitude journal, and... Um, it is 
one that I write in every day and or pretty much every day once in a while once in a while I'll skip but I try and write three things that I'm grateful for in this journal each day so that's what this one is I do have some things that I have stuck in here these are some things from my friend Shanna that I was I was grateful for so I put in there and these uh, digital images are from Maura McDonald uh, she's bygones cards on Etsy so yeah so I just made this little journal and this is my um, this is my gratitude journal so these two live by my bed the daily and and the gratitude journal and I write in them at night so that's that's what those are this little journal um, was made by my friend Diane Hubert, and uh, it's a vintage book, as you can see. And so this is my reading journal. And so in here I have, um, oh, I have a list of books that I had read early in my retirement. Um, and then just some, some thoughts about this and that. Then this is a list of books by Lisa Gardner, who's one of my favorite authors. I was having trouble keeping track of the ones I'd read and the ones I hadn't. So I just made myself a little list, went on the internet and got all of her books and um, listed them out. And now I can check them off. I just finished my last entry was The Third Victim by Lisa Gardner. And then um, this book I read before that one was a new author recommended by a friend. His name's Stuart Woods. He was okay, I, but I don't like him as well as Lisa Gardner. So anyway, I just kind of keep track of what I've read and whether it's good, whether it's not, whether it's another author that I want to read more of their books or whatever. So this little book is my reading book and lives up on the, sh on the, we have kind of a, a little den library type thing and it lives up on the shelves there. And then when I'm done with a book, I can pull it down and do a little book review in here. So that's that one. Um, this one is a Mrs. Cog's journal and it's the artist is, um, what it was called. And, um, in here I've been trying to kind of, um, these are some, these are some cards of some friends and art friends. And I've been just kind of trying to, um, document my art journey. I'm, I'm way behind on this one. Um, I really am a couple years behind. I need to catch, catch this journal up. So that, that's a to-do. That's definitely a to-do that I need to get done. But, um, but I just thought it was fun in this artist journal to write about my journey. And then last but not least, the, uh, the last one that I'm currently working on, and you've seen me work in this, you saw me put it together kind of, um, it is my journal journal where I keep all of my stuff having to do with journals. So I have all the video ideas that you guys have given me over the, over, um, I, I think on a giveaway I had you give me ideas and I need to look through and see what all I've done and then get some, get some things, um, get some uh, other things that you wanted to see, get those done. But so that's that. This is a custom orders area that is just, it's full of notes. I had to put in an extra, I've got an extra kind of a wait list thing going on the little golden books and, and things. So that's that. Um, journal ideas, some journals that I want to make and haven't yet. And then um, happy mail notes as well. So the, this is everything journaling, and this little traveler's notebook was made by Diane Hubert as well. So as you can see, um, I do use my journals. I mean, some of, the, some of the ones that I have in my shelf are really just for inspiration and um, just to look at. I, uh, for instance, Diane Hu I ha have uh, Wizard of Oz by Diane Hubert that I absolutely love, but I just look through it. I don't know that I'll ever write in it. 
but but some of these others definitely definitely so I just wanted to kind of give you an idea maybe there's an idea there of of a journal that you could make for yourself there's a hundred million ideas on Pinterest as well um, like the bullet journaling I've never really done that particular style of but there's a lot of great ideas of things that you can journal about um, some a, a few people have said to me with the daily journal oh I, I couldn't write that I couldn't write in a journal daily about my day it'd just be boring which may, may mine probably is too but um, but I just I like documenting my days I like I like kind of knowing what happened and so um, so there's that but there's a lot of other subject matters you can do besides just saying what happened during the day so that that is my little that is my little show and tell on all my journals I'm currently using and now we've added this big beauty to it too and thank you all so much for your comments on that video that was super fun to do so we will just see you in the next video and thanks again everyone check out the ladies below <laughs> bye bye